So what do you do when you show up to cast your ballot and they tell you you've already voted? You see, this happened today to a Cobb County man, and he talked to Channel 2's Lori Wilson live in Marietta. And Lori, he told you that he believes that's something that he would have remembered doing. That's right. The voter I spoke with said that he waited in line for an hour only to be told that he could only cast a provisional ballot today because he had already voted and he wasn't the only one. My scarlet letter, if you will. Cobb County voter Michael Witten shows us the letter he got explaining his provisional status. He says he went to cast his ballot Tuesday morning. He handed the poll worker his ID and then she hands me my yellow card and I take my card, take two steps. And as I'm taking two steps away, she says, Mr. Witten, wait, stop. You've already voted. He was shocked. I said, no, I, I think I would have remembered that. That would have stuck out in my mind. He said she had looked up his name on an electronic voter system. She says, no, I see here that you voted, and uh, it looks like several days ago. And I went, okay, can you give me more details? She's like, I actually can't. Instead, he was sent to cast a provisional ballot and told the county had up to three days to resolve the issue. Why is it so hard to validate who someone says they are? We have a very easy system. It's on the back of our driver's license. That makes you feel like... Wow, well, was, it, was it even worth my time and, and why do I even do this again in the future? By the way, a poll worker told Witten that this was the third time that someone had that same complaint going to the polls and saying that they had already been voted, that they had already been counted their vote. Live in Marietta, Lori Wilson, Channel 2 Action News.